Good afternoon, guys. So, um, I told you I was going to show you how I made a swaddle. Not swaddle. <laughs> I keep doing that. How I make, I'm going to make a wrap. Hopefully, it turns out this is my first time making it. So, what I did was um, I went to Walmart. As you guys know, I bought fabric at Walmart. If you saw my other video, if not, I'll make a link down below. Um, but that fabric was two yards, two yards and 34 inches, I believe. Um, which turns out like that's the sew method. So if I wanted to do that, I had to cut it in half and then sew it together to make five yards. So instead, I got five yards of fabric. This is the fabric that I got. It's jersey. It's the fabric. Um, there's five yards of it. It cost. I got it at Walmart too. It cost five dollars. This one was on sale, so it was a dollar, dollar a yard. So it costs five dollars. So I got five yards, and if I cut it in half, it makes two wraps. So if one's dirty, I can put one in the wash, etc. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do that before the baby wakes up, before I have to finish my paper, before Chris gets back, and before we get a couch. <laughs> Trying to do all of it at once. So I'll show you guys. So this is the five yards. Um, it's really, really long, as you guys can tell. And I'm going to cut this bad boy in half. I'm going to cut it in half. This is the opening spot. So I'm going to cut it in half. Figgy wants to be in the camera. I'm going to cut it in half on the, the seam that's, you know, that they have it folded already in the store. Okay, so I flipped it around. So what I want to do is, see this part's the open part? And so I flipped it around and I'm going to cut along the seam. All five yards. Okay, so now I have two pieces of the five yards. This is the five, the second, the first piece. I could hem it to make it even, but let's just see how I did. Okay, so I guess in order to do a wrap, you fold it in half like that. You fold it in half, right? Because they sit inside. Let's get this off. Okay. So this is the stretchy side, as you can tell. And I'm short. <laughs> so. So you have to find the middle. So you can fold a tag on it. Find the middle. So you find the middle, take it, crisscross, right? Hold your shoulders. Cross like that again. Okay, not even. You know, you take it, you step it in. Okay, and you crisscross it over whichever way you want her legs to tuck in. So you crisscross it. 
both the open and the side facing me. Okay, you just pass it over, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> and then you just go around and tie it off. And you have your swamp, you already have that. I'll show you how I work it out when she wakes up. Okay, so I have my fussy baby who I'm going to swaddle, or wraps, huh? So we're going to get you in here. Maybe. Struggles real, guys. Okay, and then you get this part, the bottom part. You bring it up, over. She's hungry though, guys. Oh, no, no. So I hope we got that. I put one leg in first, Chris called. Put one leg first in and then the other one. And then I took the wrap, I pulled it up and tucked it under. And to make this more secure, I can tie it more around me. So now she's in there, huh, baby? You in here? So now she's in. Got her seat, her legs are all in a good position. Got it crisscrossed over and up, huh? So now just about to see how secure it is. I could make it tighter so that way she's a little higher, but she's in a good spot. So I'm gonna get going, guys, because she's trying to. She's rooting, so she's hungry. Even though she had six hours before she went to sleep, which was about two hours ago, one hour ago. So I'm gonna feed baby girl vacuum. See how this works out with the vacuum without holding her. And see how she responds. So now she's holding her head up, so this is okay position. She could probably face the other side soon. So you see the camera? The light's shiny, yeah. So with that, I say thank you guys for watching. I don't think you guys can see me. <laughs> thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And leave any questions or comments down below. I believe it's not disabled. And thank you guys for joining along with the ride. If you guys want to see any more DIYs, just let me know. And I'll try to get to you guys as fast as possible. Put her arms inside, huh? Put your arms in here so you won't be all wobbly wobbly. And then you can probably feed her in here too going out. But yeah, on that note guys, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.